Sign up at the end of this review to get my personal gear list. Hey folks, Tony Policastro here from the Acoustic Letter. Today we're gonna to look at a custom 12 fret from Taylor, but before we do so, I just wanted to let you know, there are tons of people signed up for the Acoustic Letter right now, and they absolutely love it. Please click the link below to hear some of their testimonials, and if you like what they have to say, please do sign up. On to the Taylor Custom 12 fret. This one has a bit of a story. I, I gotta tell it to you. So earlier in the year, in March, Levi here and I went out to Taylor to take the university, learn more, see how they made guitars, and pick out some custom woods. This guitar is a result of our finds. And my hair was much shorter then, it's longer now, but that's not the subject of this particular review. We're gonna look at a Taylor Custom 12 fret that we designed. What we have is a Euro spruce top, ebony bridge, ebony bridge pins, bone saddle, beautiful ebony rosette that matches the ebony binding. We have a dark, stark black ebony fingerboard with small dot inlay, slotted headstock with Taylor inlaid mother pearl, an inch and three quarter bone nut, mahogany neck with a standard carve. We have beautiful ivory button slotted headstock tuners, again on that mahogany standard carved neck, and an absolutely gorgeous piece of Macassar ebony. This is a piece that we hand selected when we were out in Taylor in March, and lo and behold, here it is a guitar. So I just got done picking woods at the Taylor factory. It was fairly quick, but I had in my mind exactly what I wanted. I was thinking a small body guitar, incredibly responsive, kind of built for finger style, ragtime, alternate tunings, that kind of thing. So we chose a really killer piece of Macassar ebony back and sides. There's lots of planes here, way more here than in Montana. Uh, some caster ebony back and sides, and we also chose a Euro spruce top, which will add some really, really cool responsiveness to it. It'll respond to a really light touch and make those alternate tunings come out incredibly well. So we're really excited to watch this thing go through the process. Got to finalize the little details, but all the hard work is done so far. acoustic reviews and comparisons, click the button to subscribe to our YouTube channel.